So traditionally about this time I'd like to go to the gym, but right now my body just does not feel good. You always have to listen to your body, never push it too far because something will break or you will hurt yourself. Always listen to your body. So as of today for my workout, I'm gonna go on a three mile walk with my dog Roxy. And I can't bring this camera because it's pretty big so it get pretty heavy. So I'm gonna be recording on my phone for most of today's video. I like walking to this neighborhood because it gives me motivation to see where I'd like to end up or as far as where I want to buy a house. I think the houses to this neighborhood are very, very nice. Super gorgeous. Uh, and I always walk through here because everybody here is so friendly. I've been stopped multiple times, not only for my dog, but just to say hi to me and talk to me and just see who I am. So it's very nice walking through here. Um, I'm actually super impressed by the quality of the iPhone, not gonna lie. So I think I might just honestly buy a little stick, like a selfie stick, and just kind of start vlogging with this when I go out. Cause this doesn't look bad on the phone. So we'll see how it turns out when I edit it. So another good thing about this past week is that I finally hit a new record low of weight. So right now I'm currently at 214.2, which means hopefully by December we have about, or by Christmas before I go home, a little under three weeks. So hopefully in two weeks I can be down to at least 212, maybe 213. We'll see. Uh, I'm trying for always a healthy but fast weight loss. Because losing too much weight too quickly is also very bad for your health. Keep that in mind. Okay, so I just got back from my walk with my dog and these are gonna be the calories and how long it took me, how long I walked, etc. So, three, to, three mile walk took me an hour and one minute, okay? In that three miles, I burned 364 active calories and almost 500 total calories, so 498. Uh, all it takes is an hour. That's it. An hour a day and you can burn a good amount of calories. And it's not even hard, it's walking. You always walk anyway, so might as well just you know, get something positive out, out of it. Uh, 22 started off slower, two and three were good paced, and then four, mile four I don't understand how I had a mile four but all of which very good very simple very easy calories burned that you were normally gonna do in your day anyways of just walking you don't need to run you don't need to do bike you don't need to do high intensity if you don't want to you could literally just walk and fix your diet around that as simple as that easy day as far as my diet goes still doing low carb keeping the calories as low as possible uh, without feeling you know starved or tired all the time granted I still do feel tired because I'm not eating carbs but here's the kicker I do not ex exclude carbs if I wish to I will have you know carbs that day I will eat rice beans shit even french fries uh, I had chicken tenders and french fries yesterday and I just appropriated the calories for the rest of the day I didn't have a very big breakfast. I think I had those little egg white cups from Starbucks, and those are like 170 calories. And I'm assuming the whole, it was like three chicken strips and a, a serving of fries. So I'm assuming that was like 1,100 to 1,200 calories. So I just ate something very, very small, maybe like another like couple egg whites and two pieces of turkey bacon. That alone is maybe 100 calories. So just appropriate your diet. If you, do, if you wish to eat something that isn't very healthy, that is okay. Don't do it every day, but it is okay to do it every once in a while. Just don't go over your calories. Simple as that. If you want to lose weight, caloric deficit, live by it, learn it. Simple as that. But as far as the physique update you saw at the beginning of the video, that's what I look like when I literally just wake up. Uh, I planned it out yesterday that I'm going to leave my camera next to my bed so as soon as my alarm goes off at 6 a.m. just instead of turning it off immediately, grab my camera, start recording it just so you can really see what it's like, how I look when I wake up. Because during the day you start eating, you drink water, and your body just gets naturally bigger. So that is what I look like on an empty stomach, no water, nothing like that for over 8 hours. Um, and as far as working out, still lifting weights every single day. Uh, I'm going to keep only lifting weights until... I hit a plateau. 
a plateau meaning I'm not losing any weight for like a week or two straight and then at that point then I will start slowly introducing cardio um, as far as my three mile walk I don't really consider that cardio like I know it is but it's like I, I consider cardio to be more of like running or a sport or something that gets your heart rate moving um, but until then I'm only gonna keep lifting weights and see how far that gets me because I'm really hoping to get at least to like 205 with just weights and then I'll start running for the last 20 pounds but that is gonna be it for today's update I appreciate each and every one of you that watch my videos if you don't subscribe that's fine if you don't like that's fine my goal is not to be the biggest person out there my goal is to just inspire others and motivate others to better themselves whether it be fitness whether it be something else maybe maybe it's a business who knows you don't have to take what I do directly and apply it to yourself but see how I am trying and pushing myself to do better and I want you to do the same but that is going to be it thank you all for watching my name is Matthew always remember keep running towards your dreams you never know what will happen peace